Hi, and welcome to our channel, All About Home Electronics. What you see on your screen right now, it's the Amazon Fire TV Cube and the Amazon Fire TV Stick. In this video, we're gonna show you the proper connections for how to connect your Fire TV device to your surround sound AVR, which port to plug in, which cable to use, and what setting adjustments to make on your AVR as well as your Fire TV device, and we're gonna begin right after this. To begin, we want to make sure that the surround sound AVR is connected properly to the TV. In this particular example, this is an ARC-enabled HDMI input, and we're using an HDMI cable which is rated high speed. We're going to plug the other end into the HDMI out, which is also ARC-enabled on the back of the surround sound AVR. In our example, we're using the Amazon Fire TV Cube, and it does output a 4K Ultra HD video picture. And our surround sound receiver, our AVR, happens to support that type of resolution. So again, there's a connection for the HDMI on the back of the Fire TV Cube. You want to also use a high-speed rated HDMI cable and plug it into the Cube. Now on the back of this particular AVR, there are five different HDMI ports. We're gonna wanna use the port which is 4K enabled, and that's identified by the letters HDCPP 2.2, and we're gonna plug the other end of that same HDMI cable into one of these ports here. You could plug the other end into a different HDMI port, you just won't get the 4K video resolution on your TV if you were to do that. As for the Amazon Fire TV stick, it's gonna depend upon which version you have. Some versions output a 4K resolution, older versions do not. As with the case that we're showing in this example, it does not output a 4K resolution. So we're gonna plug it into one of the older HDMI ports here. And when you slip it in, you might notice in our example that we're actually blocking this other HDMI port. Amazon has included this extender and we're going to use it in this example. There's an advantage to plugging your Amazon Fire TV device into the surround sound AVR directly as opposed to connecting it to your TV directly. And that is that uh, not all TVs are going to pass the audio signal back down to your surround sound receiver. Whereas when you plug it straight into the surround sound receiver, you're probably always going to hear sound. Many, many times we get questions about, hey, we don't hear any sound. We see a picture, we don't hear any sound. And the question is really so broad that it's difficult to answer. And so that's why we think it's an advantage to plug it straight into your surround sound receiver. But this video wouldn't be complete if we didn't talk about a couple of setting adjustments that you may want to take a look at. Your surround sound receiver is gonna be different than our example, but you can see here on the screen, currently it's gonna to try to process a seven channel stereo signal, and we don't want that. So we're gonna use the program button and simply go to surround sound decode automatic. That might not be what displays on your AVR screen, but look for something similar to that. Additionally, we wanna check out the settings in the Amazon TV Fire device, and we grab the remote, navigate over to the settings and then down and over to display and sound and then down again audio in this case which this is the cube the audio is set to surround sound best available some of the other options would be stereo or Dolby Digital all the time but if your surround sound receiver doesn't process Dolby Digital you're either gonna hear just two channel stereo or no sound at all. So in this case, we're gonna use best available. The audio setting options will vary depending upon which Amazon Fire TV device you're using. In this particular screen, we're looking at the audio setting options for the Amazon Fire TV stick. You see that Dolby Digital over HDMI is an option and we can scroll up 
In this particular case, we're leaving it to Dolby Digital Plus Automatic. Now, if your AVR does not process that code sound, then your AVR is going to play a two-channel stereo. This concludes this video on how to properly connect an Amazon Fire TV device to a surround sound AVR. If you have any questions, please post them in the comments below the video. Here are a few video links we hope you might find useful. If you liked this video or it helped you, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe free to our channel. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.